Hello everybody! So it's festival season and I figured while my hair is still rainbow I'm going to do some festival hair accessories and stuff like that because every year I want to do this and I always never get around to it. So I went to Hobby Lobby and I just got a bunch of colorful strings and ribbons and things on sale, whatever craft store you have. And then I also got these colorful buttons and this is just some junk that I had laying around in my craft stuff. Some beads and little keys and locks and then talons. I don't know if I'll actually use these but I figured that's probably really cool. And um, there's a lot of colors and rainbow colors and weird things so I figure, you know, festival stuff it's gotta be tacky to be good, right? You can use whatever colors you want and match your hair or whatever. I even got this right here that I am most excited about. Oh yeah, look at that. And then these beads. They're so pretty. They actually have different rainbow colors in them and everything. Some green sparkly string and some rainbow string and pink and yellow and all these colors and it will match my nails. I don't know what it is about this season right now, but I just want to be rainbow and tacky AF. So I'm going to be doing this on my extensions, and I'm just going to tie the strings directly to my extensions. Um, if you don't have extensions, just take a bobby pin or one of those little bendy clips, and you're going to tie it to those instead, and then just pin it into your hair um, instead of clipping extensions into your hair. So the first thing I'm going to do is decide which colors I like with which um, colors of my hair or if you don't have colorful hair just decide which colors you like together I am going to be braiding all of these but I also want them to be kind of contrasting so that they really stand out so this blue matches the blue on these extensions and I like it against the red but I may also put yellow in there or this green with the pink yeah maybe the green and the pink just because they're really bright together. So I'm going to measure against the length of my hair, but a little bit shorter because I might curl my hair. And then I'm going to double that length. So make double the length of your hair, plus a little bit of room for tying a knot. Once you have your strands cut, fold them in half so that you have the middle. And at this point, you would tie it to a clip if you're going to use a clip. But because I'm using extensions, I'm just going to Let me zoom in for you. I'm just going to make a part right next to a clip above my little part. And I'm going to send the strings, I'm going to hold the loop at the top of the weft, send the strings back and through the top and then come through the loop. Just like so. Then I'm separating the strands into three parts so that I can start braiding. Now as I get closer to the bottom, I'm going to start adding little um, beads and things that I might want on there. So I'm going to add one of these and maybe this yellow flower and maybe a key.
Then to tie off the end, I'm just going to take one of the strands and wrap around it a few times. And then do the same thing with another one, but going the opposite direction. And then tie it. Oh, my first accessory finished. So that's all there is to it. It's super easy. You can take them off of your hair extensions easy because it's just looped around. You just have to send it back through the loop and super cute when you move around they sparkle and you get more color like if you don't have colorful hair like mine you can add pops of color i just added random strings in there too just super fun and summery and all that fun stuff if you want to see how i did the makeup in this little clip i'll have that link down below hope you guys enjoyed this video it is storming outside so i'm gonna finish this voiceover i'll see you guys in my next video Bye-bye.